This is called Make It TV. Sarkozy has dropped a tactical song to close the year 2022. But then this same song is starting violence in the year 2023. He calls it Landlord. There's this debate out there that who is the landlord of Ghanaian music. Shatta claims he's the one. But then success, this song is going to stamp the authority that he has as the landlord in Ghanaian music. He has quoted a lot of things in the song. This same song is sending a strong reply to Nasty C. Because Nasty C granted an interview somewhere and he was making certain claims about Sarkozy. Success, Nasty, keep quiet. I am the landlord of the game. The landlord of African rap music. I'll get you into it. People are of the view that Sarkozy, you know, anytime he's dropping a song, he's more or less sympathizing with MPP. Systems are very hard. We are expecting Sarkozy to bring a song to talk about a hardship because he did it to our Tamils. Okodi has sent a strong reply to those Ghanaians saying that. And I'm going to take my time to damage it to your understanding. The title of the song is Landlord Ghana. Let's get into it. This one be Lepers Dance. Leper. I am the Scorpion Dance. We are ending the year. But then success, let's start 2023 with violence. It is crazy. <laughs> Shit, it's amazing, I still got it Man, I'm so addicted to winning, it's like a habit You don't think it's magic, you want me to pull a rabbit Long fucking journey, my people, now think about it I start <laughs> Hey, hey, hey The first three lines is trying to rhyme So he'll give you habits And fuse in rabbits Hey, hey Habit and rabbit. Let's take those lines again Cordier decided to stay in the English zone To show us to see that if you claim that you are a strong rapper in English I can do chi, I can count your comfort zone, which is English, and still prove to you, nasty, that you're a small boy in the game. Let's pick the opening lines again. Shit is amazing, I still got, got it. it. Man, I'm so addicted to winning, it's like a habit. habit. You don't think it's magic, you want me to pull a rabbit. rabbit. Long fucking journey, my people, now think about it. I started rapping when all you niggas were stuck in the womb. Oh, see, he started rapping when all the niggas were stuck in the womb. Sending a strong warning to nasty. See, in South Africa, the nasty be steady. He's a senior brother and landlord in the game. Of course, then you say, I know person was stamp my we are saying who's a rap or not just a oh he add them more pens on the starting. That I started rapping when all you guys were you were not just in the womb or you were stuck in the womb. To be paved with the rap door and answer I'm more nasty me other guys in the year muti. Then I walk to interview our best what you say what for the bang. If you're Pepe Pay, still the highest in the room. I gotta take a break, don't worry, I'm coming soon. <laughs> Look at how he introduced him, Fio Pepe Pay. Only Mabad is a deep literature term, be or English. Or Chen Nasty said, he can code switch. That in Fio Pepe Pay, or the shame, or I'm fine, Fio Pepe Pay side, maybe in Mabad the poem. People not think about it, I started rapping with all you niggas were stacked in the room. If you're Pepe Pe, still the highest in the room. I gotta take a break, don't worry, I'm coming soon. Tommy P.I., you see me wake you, be at the boom. It's not an easy road, I thank God. I put in a lot of work, so they call me the landlord. The position I play, I can't talk, I'm a big bro. Gotta help niggas who can't walk. I'm the biggest inspiration to your favorite rapper. That he is the biggest inspiration to your favorite rapper. Ah, obie be does my up and coming rapper. So people like Black Sheriff, all the young guys in the system, they see him as the landlord. That the biggest inspiration to your favorite rapper. So who are you, Nasty C? Now he's going to open the door of Nasty C here, Tim Mame. I ain't trying to be cocky faced, I do it proper. I heard a young champ is hurt. I'm sorry, but anytime you meet the highest, all you need is just a marker. Grab an autograph and get a fuck out. <laughs> That he had a young champ is hurt. So clearly throwing a job at Nasty C that he's a young champ. People have laid the foundation. So anytime you see the landlord as a young champ, all you need is a marker. Come to champ and get an autograph. It's enough. What do you mean by only shake hands with the boss? What do you mean by only shake hands? You want to eat with the king. That all you need, just get a marker, get closer. Bow like this, let him sign for you. Then you take that shit off. That is a baby, poor baby. So
So he will strategically come in at an unexpected time. Nasty made these statements two, three weeks ago, uh, some few weeks ago. But then look at Kodye. Today is the final day, 31st. Jabbing it direct, settling all the scores in 2022 in the final day. Opening a new beef in 2023. If you're a man venture, he will not mind you unexpectedly. He will come and reply you. Now listen to what Nasty C said that has generated this sort of, you know, back and forth from the powerful landlord. Listen to Nasty C's statements. The interview he granted Ghana. And we bumped into to, to Sark, you know. Um, I think he was standing with his manager or it had to be somebody he worked with. So here he's talking about Sark here. That he bumped into Sark here during an MTV awards program. So he did his performance, but then he was nobody. He was still up and coming. So Sarko, they, they were the faces of that event. So that after the performance, you know, he had admired Okodia for a long time. So he bumped into Sarko, the, that leader. Bless your boy, because I see myself to be the future. Listen to what happened. And when I went up to him for, for a handshake, and obviously I was young, I was young, I was young as hell. I doubt he even knew who I was, do you know what I mean? And even if he did, I don't think he thought I was that important type thing. You know, so I went up to him for like a, a handshake and he kind of just, he, you know, kind of just like snubbed me, so to say. So that he went to Sarkodie for a handshake and Sarkodie snubbed him. Kodie, you know, showing that level that, hey, who are you? So that Kodie snubbed him. And, you know, he felt it that I need to prove something to the world. I need to let this man know that in future he will also come knocking at my door. So that when he also became a global eye everywhere, Okodia then messaged him for a verse. He says, no, if you did it to me yesterday, I will also do it to you today. So I'm going to pay you by your own deeds. So he didn't give Okodia that verse. So then he granted the interview and presented this story. Okodia didn't mind him. Today is 31st. He's now responding to the guy in this powerful song titled Landlord. Let's get back to the song. I'm always on the highway. We present it the way we encountered it. Let's get back to the song. So Okodia will clearly give it to him here. I ain't gotta shake your hand so you can walk out. And so you know it's not me. You're fighting your own ego. Maybe a couple things you gotta sort out. See, I ain't got no pride to reach out to nobody. I love that nigga. Yo, we go be so baggy. I'ma be the biggest hypocrite acting like I don't cap. So no, Korea, that I will still not shake you. You gotta fuck out somewhere. Who are you? You think you've gotten there. Even if you are there, I'm the landlord. And don't lie to the world. I don't need your verse for anything. And it's a healthy beef. You know, the boy is now up there in South Africa. Okori also sees himself as the eye of West Africa. So when he brought it out, Okori decided to face him squarely. So today is 31st. So we are waiting for Nasty to come out. Then 2023 is going to be violence. Let's take Okori's reply again. This is beef against beef in Dogana. I forget a fuck out. I ain't gotta shake your hands so you can walk out. And so you know it's not me. You're fighting your own ego. Maybe a couple things you gotta sort out. See, I ain't got no pride to reach out to nobody. I love that nigga. Your ego be so baggy. I'm a bit. Your ego is so baggy. You gotta fuck up who are you. Who are you calling on that way now? And nasty. I'm calling Timu Dobe. I'm a guy. I'm a nasty. No physically. Can nasty challenge. The biggest hypocrite acting like I don't cap, cause we all do. It's like I'm crushing my own body, yeah. Don't get it twisted, I'm still a fan. But don't you get carried away, I'm still the man. I never reached out, homie. But I know what you do is such a smart ass. Touching a god so, is part of the plan, huh? That is, so Korea says, yeah, he understands. It's part of the game, you know, to chase that clout. He likes his music, you know. I'm still a fan. But I need to know the difference. You need to know that I'm still a big brother. So if you are granting interviews of this nature, you need to know how you frame your words. Don't hurt the soul. Don't let me, you know, don't let me curse you in the game because I'm the landlord. Don't let me set that eye on you. <laughs> hey, the baby pong. That shit is old but still work This like Jay responding to Lil Durk This the price you pay when you swallow the pill first Again, I'm sorry just in case you still hurt uh, Lack of knowledge my people perish So this is the price you pay 
if you swallow the pill first, you decided to grant the interview. So this is what Okori has given to you. Comparing this situation to Jay-Z and Lil Deck, it can happen. Okori sees nasty as that small boy. So how can you talk to your father this way? Politics, the reality, what do you cherish? Nana to us, so I believe they wanna say it because free education brought so yeah, it deserves some credit. So he has switched into politics. You know, he dropped that song with Kwame Yojin. It's a brand new day. Clink, clink. And we say, Nana to us. And we say, he has not regretted because free education value, you know, or benefit free. You know. So, wow, so Ghanaians pushing him. So, oh yeah, you know, to endorse this candidate, you no, know, things are not going well. Come out and drop a new song. Talking about the hardship in the system. I say, no, it is politics and you can't force me to do something against my wish. And if that is what is going to kill me, I'm ready to stick my head out. Bere pon bere sack. Let's take those slides again. Bere no no. It's to pay when you swallow the pill first. Again, I'm sorry, just in case you still hurt. Uh. Lack of knowledge, my people perish. Politics and reality, what do you cherish? Nana twa, so I believe they wanna say it because free education brought me so yeah, it deserves some credit. Was it free education brought so it deserves some credit? Even if everything about the government is bad, free education deserves some credit. Soon as some people heard it, turn into politics, fabricating propaganda, go position the spread it. I ask myself if I regret it. Nah, if they wanna kill me, then I'm ready. Now back to the main topic. I can make us up a damn, I said fuck it. I only speak when I move, I'm like a prophet. Yes. What is it? Was it like a prophet? Oh, who I know I can do a movie. To whom to me, mom, I can't say what can I say. No, he's also a Ghanaian and he can share his opinion. And with you people stop with the bureau, but could be a politician and share the skills. I think the Jenny Fiji me into the Bama Kawano phone it to the position the Jaw Bills. So here, probably Jab and Kevin Taylor and the other guys. That Kawano tune. Jai Jimmy, you know, attempt the DNA more opposition, you know, the trial bills and thing I will buy also by kind of the painting a buying it, sir. So you can't force me to do what I'm not supposed to do. So I've got a job in the system, maybe I can't be here. So now tell me how it feels. I'm about to worry about the do your young one more, but you vote. If I see t shirt about the palm show, would you put him here? What could you be it? I should be coat. The same episode. What's the impossible? Eh? So that it is everywhere. Opposition, party in power, all politicians are the same. About to only draw the one and the that down. But when they get the power, they forget about the people that voted for them. So I know that he has come to understand that politicians in the the crown. You can force him with a diabolic agenda. No? Say uncle obey the mouth. Suck or bury pom bury. They call this one landlord. My name is called Nick. I sit on the highway and it's all about decodings. I'll present it to you the way I encountered it. Thank you.